Hello everybody and welcome to my brand new video series on Smash, which I'm going to call The Breakdown. This is going to break down some uh, really good fights I've had in the past. And, um, you know, we'll watch it and I'll give you the play-by-play -play as it goes down. I'm going to try to do a lot of these videos uh, whenever a good fight comes up. So um, this is the first one that I've had against the Samus player. It's Elite Smash. Um, we're going to watch it. I'm going to break it down and we're going to see what you know, the outcome and how I turned literally won these fights. So let's go ahead and start this one here. Uh, this Samus player starting with uh, charging the cannon, which is what all Spamus players do. Okay, there you go. She's spamming the little, little bombs, keeping me at a distance and on my toes and just launching that cannon every chance she got. Keeping me at a distance. That's this player's particular game, just zoning. Again, spamming more bombs, missiles, catching me with the throw. And at this point, I'm screwed because I'm on the edge. And um, that neutral with the bomb thing and yeah, the cannon, I can't. That thing's invincible, so you can never get out of it. But here we go. Hit him with the lunch punch. Again, this particular player is always moving. A missile, throwing me, another bomb. Bombing, bombing, bombing. So pretty much, I never really get a chance to get established because there's either a bomb, cannon, something being thrown. So right away I'm down 0-2, okay? Trying to come back. Harden that cannon. Missing the lunch punch. There it is. They're just, at this point, this player is just keeping me at a distance, not letting me get set up. They can tell I'm pretty much desperate at this point. I'm just buying into the game. Trying to get him off stage. Couldn't hit, hit him with the counter. Again. Throw. Missile bomb. Caught him with the neutral. Alright. Yep, there. Very good spacing by this Samus player. Yeah, anytime I get close, there's either a missile or a grab waiting for me. There's the grab. Throwing me. Can't wait to throw. I'm not letting me get set up whenever I can. I mean, I'm pretty much lost. This is pretty much a lost fight here. So out of desperation, I got him off stage. So this is where the player messes up. At this point they don't think I have an advantage. Rightfully so. I mean I'm getting my butt handed to me. They're pretty much taking it easy on me. Alright, got him on the lunge, hit him with the running neutral, got him off stage. Hit them knocked out. They didn't anticipate that. So now, they're starting to realize there's a fight here. But they have the control. So they're pretty much just waiting. All I need is one strong hit and I'm done. And that's what this player is biding their time to do. And... Very good, keeping the spacing any chance they got. Now that's critical hit, it supposedly killed me, but it didn't, I came back. Oh, blocking, dodging, trying to throw. Now they know at this point the pressure's on. They didn't expect this fight to be as good as, good it, is, as it is. Alright, just trying to buy time here, but I caught him with that neutral. That forward. Countered. Staying on stage. Again, just trying to keep me off the stage, but I hit him with the KO punch. And I beat him. So I literally came back from a uh, 3-1 stock deficit and uh, was able to beat this player. So... This video is kind of rough because I'm just kind of like ad-libbing it as I go along. 
But uh, I'm going to try to do a better job when I do make these videos because uh, I think that, I mean, they're pretty good videos to watch. So uh, this is the first one. There'll be many more. And uh, thank you for watching.